Many other societies don't have this specific you know, focus, which drives people to come to this society, but also it really fosters the trainees and, and gives them opportunities to present and, and build that lifeline of membership that's gonna continue. For people just entering the field, whether it's because you're a new trainee or uh, you're someone who used to work on small molecules and now you find yourself on a gene or cell therapy product, what is amazing about ASGCT is it gives you that cross-functional exposure to things outside the realm of what you're going to be working on. The importance of mentoring, teaching, being there for students and postdocs and your people in the lab. That has always been a very, very important aspect. One of the items of advice I often give is you want to start talking to the labs and talking to the groups that you want to go work for. Here's your opportunity to meet them, maybe start up collaboration. What keeps me in ASGCT is the community. This is a group that really knits together all aspects of cell and gene therapy from CMC to preclinical to clinical for us to really do the best by patients. Um, we need that community and we need that cross-functional interaction in order to continue to improve what we're doing for patients. I came back to ASGCT again because I felt like it was a good size and it was accessible and I felt like opportunities were available for trainees to um, be active. They have a lot of actually travel awards for um, trainees, more than I've seen in, in most other societies. It's always going to be a team sport. And so I, in general, uh, advocate for everyone on my team to at least get exposure at this meeting, be a member. This is certainly the place to, to keep abreast of all the different advances. Almost everyone we work with comes to the society. We have the basic science and we have the translational component and the actual clinical application. That is very unique. Many other societies focus more on the clinical aspect or stay very basic. I'm very, very happy to see uh, how we've grown, how we continue to grow, and very, very happy.